Hello, it's Friday the 17th. It's St. Patrick's Day. Green. I'm FX Blue and this is the Market Brief. Now, after all the strikes, the protests, the bad blood, uh, the government has finally reached an agreement with the nurses and the ambulance crews. Uh, they'll get a 5% pay rise uh, in April and a minimum lump sum of around 1,700 quid for the current year. Meanwhile, the budget is still being digested and Hunt has been criticised for suggesting there will be no recession this year. Technically, he might be right, as we may well avoid two quarters of negative growth, uh, but the critics suggest that he's papering over the cracks there because conditions will feel like a recession in every other measurable way. Um, the ECB voted for another 50 basis point rate hike. Uh, Lagarde acknowledged the banking sector problems uh, and pledged support if necessary. But she said that the Eurozone banks are far better capitalised than they were back in 2008. Uh, so they should be better able to deal with any fallout. Uh, for now, market volatility to one side, we have avoided any real issues from Credit Suisse, or Debit Suisse, as they should be called, with their balance sheet. Oh, on fire. Uh, but the contagion risk does remain, uh, so we can expect conditions to remain a little bit twitchy and a bit reactive for the time being. The risk off trading is driving the volatility and driving safe haven flow, which is strengthening the dollar. Over in the US, the Fed was forced to give uh, emergency loans to First Republic Bank when they were unable to raise liquidity yesterday. Uh, Congress is concerned that the Fed rate hikes are contributing to all the current turmoil, but Yellen still believes that the US banking sector is pretty sound. She was testifying before legislators yesterday where her broad remit seems to have been provide assurances, deny any suggestions that it was a bailout, and do not mention contagion. Uh, we've got the Fed meeting next week. The last two employment remor uh, reports show the jobs market remains very strong. Um, and the job's not done on inflation, but with the current market turmoil and all the uncertainty over what else may be down the tracks, it might be inappropriate for a 50 basis point rate hike. Expectation has dropped towards a 25 basis point being the most likely outcome. In the market, sterling opens around 121.60 against the dollar. We're about 114 against the euro and euro dollar is around 106.65 this morning. And that's it from me. Have a great weekend. Do enjoy a couple of pints of the black stuff tonight, but do drink responsibly. Join me again on Monday. All the best. If you do not have a clue, then just tweet through and ask FX Blue.